It's a final in Tempe as Arizona State is back in action in Pac-12 play with a win in overtime against number 22, Colorado. 57-52 is the final. Alongside Joan Bombasini, I'm Cindy Brunson. The Buffaloes put on a defensive show led by the freshman, Kendall Weta. Oh, Kendall Weta. She was like a steel machine. Hey, if you had a wallet, you better hide it from her because she is picking your pocket. She had eight steals, which is her record so far in her young freshman career, but she can do it all. She filled the stat sheet, had some rebounds, scored a little bit, but it just wasn't enough tonight. Yeah, Colorado with 19 total steals, but come up short in large part because of the play of Taya Hansen. She was fantastic. She was fantastic and scored so many different ways. Most people look at her as a three-point shooter, which she definitely is, but she also could put it on the ground. She is smart. She is a leader for this team. And I really believe when she gets her confidence going, and it's there right now, Arizona State is a dangerous team. She led all scores with 17 points on three of six shooting. ASU gets Pac-12 win number one, a 14th straight win against Colorado. And the number 22 buffs now are rocking a three-game slide as they head to number 10 Arizona on Sunday. Up next for ASU, Utah on Sunday. Thanks for watching Pac-12 Women's Basketball.